Hello and welcome to FDK TV, powered by Data Meaning and brought to you by Darren Holmblad. Today we're going to talk about portal integration with MicroStrategy and deploying MicroStrategy portlets to portal servers. The agenda is going to be a brief overview of what a portal is, what a portal server is, and then we're going to dive right into deploying the LifeRay portal server and then deploying the MicroStrategy portlet to that LifeRay portal server. An overview of a portal. A uh, portal is a web-based application which provides services that include single sign-on, personalization, and content aggregation from a number of sources. Some free portals that are out there include Yahoo and iGoogle. These portals offer numerous services which aggregate to a single presentation layer or location. Some of these services offered are weather, date, time, email, stocks, and news. As you can see in this screenshot, we have weather, CNN, date and time. As I have said, the content on a portal page is aggregated from a number of different sources. And CNN.com is probably aggregating from a different data source than date and time. In addition to these three portals that are out there, there are enterprise level portal servers, which will allow users to deploy their own portals. These enterprise level portal servers are or include LifeRay, SharePoint, WebSphere, Oracle, and more. MicroStrategy actually provides out-of-the-box portlets that are designed to render MicroStrategy content on these enterprise portal servers. In 931, MicroStrategy provided LifeRay, WebSphere, SharePoint, Oracle, and SAP. You can find additional information about these portal servers and the offerings of MicroStrategy's portal server, or portal server in the MicroStrategy portlet documentation that can be found on the machine that MicroStrategy is installed on. And that path is below. So today I've chosen to use the LifeRay portal server. Uh, it's easy to deploy and it's very good for testing purposes. There are two MicroStrategy provided portlets available the master portlet and the basic portlet. You can see in this screenshot, uh, we have a portal page on LifeRay and we have deployed, you know, two MicroStrategy portlets and we're rendering MicroStrategy content next to some widgets that may be useful to the, you know, end users of this portal page. So now we're just going to dive right into deploying the LifeRay portal server with an installation demo and then we're going to deploy the MicroStrategy portlet to that portal server. So the first step is to go to LifeRay.com and download the LifeRay Portal 6.1 Community Edition and you're going to want to have it bundled with Tomcat. Uh, this is just for testing purposes so bundling with Tomcat is okay. So you're going to want to download that. Once you've downloaded that you will have a directory called you know LifeRay Portal. Uh, you can see here I have 6.1 in this directory we have structure similar to Tomcat so we have our Tomcat directory and this is where you will start your portal server you can configure the port that your portal server is going to use with the server XML uh, you can see here I've chosen port 8585 So in order to start your portal server, you're just going to want to go into the Tomcat directory, 
and into bin and find the startup.bat. This will take some time the first time you start up your portal server. Great, so we can see our server startup. Once our server is started up, we just navigate to the local host and the port that we have designated for that Tomcat installation. As you can see, I've chosen 8585. Once you've done that, you are brought to the LifeRay basic configuration. Uh, this is where you define your administrator user and your portal name. I'm just going to go ahead and finish the configuration. Once that's finished, you just click go to my portal and you should be prompted with some additional setup configuration steps. Uh, in addition to accepting some terms, you define your administrator password. A security question. And this is for the administrator user that you defined on the previous page. And now we have successfully deployed our LifeRay portal. So as you can see here, uh, my user is test. That's the one I created earlier. And we have a few portal pages. And so we have officially deployed our first LifeRay portal. I'm actually going to delete these portal pages because we want to deploy MicroStrategy. So deploying MicroStrategy portlet is very simple. All we're going to do is navigate to our LifeRay portal directory and you can see here that we have a folder called deploy. So we're going to go in that folder and this is where we're going to deploy our MicroStrategy portlet. So our MicroStrategy portlet can be found within the MicroStrategy installation. So you go into program files, MicroStrategy, portlets, and since we're using the LifeRay portal server, we're going to deploy the LifeRay portal. So as you can see here, we have our MicroStrategy portlet.war file, and all we do to deploy it is copy it into our deploy directory. And once you do that, in your console, you'll see that it is deploying the folder or deploying the portlet. Okay, so once your MicroStrategy portlet is deployed, uh, we're actually going to want to restart the LifeRay portal server. So we're going to close out of that console, go back into Tomcat, bin, and click on startup.bat. So once our portal server is back online, or once our Tomcat's back online, we're going to go into LifeRay, navigate to localhost 8585, which was the port I defined. And we're going to sign in with our admin user. So first I'm going to create a new page. So you just go to add page. I'll call this MicroStrategy test. On this page, I'm going to alter the page layout by going to Manage Page Layout and choose a one column layout. It's easier to see. And save it. So now we have a new portal page. Uh, where we can deploy our MicroStrategy portal to, portlet. So we just go to add more. And now we see that the MicroStrategy portlet is available to be deployed. So we're just going to click add. Uh, and as you can see, I receive an error. Uh, server HTTP response 401 error for localhost 8080 MicroStrategy. 
And the reason is, is because that's not where my microstrategy is deployed. So in order to configure the microstrategy portlet, we're going to go to options and default preferences. The default preferences are usually available to the administrator. Uh, and this is where you define your MicroStrategy web-based URL and your web task URL. So I'm going to paste in my web-based URL and my task URL. In addition to that, we're also going to need to click Submit. That will save our preferences. So you can see that our error message has now changed. So now our MicroStrategy you know, web environment is up. So we should now... Another error message. Incorrect login password. So we need to go into Preferences and define the user that's going to log in. Submit. So now you can see that we have the MicroStrategy portlet accessing our MicroStrategy web environment. And we can navigate inside of it and run a report. There we go. So now we've deployed a MicroStrategy portlet onto a LifeRay portal server. This is very good for testing purposes or even, you know, enterprise deployment. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to comment on the video and please look out for additional videos on LifeRay portal servers, portal servers, and other series that I will be putting out. Thank you very much.